Last year, this company turned over more than two million dollars worth of business. It was very good business. Its clients were the BBC, the Brittle Networks, French, Italian and Norwegian television companies, the international film industry and Britain's top advertising agencies, among them Saatchi and Saatchi. Pro Video is strategically located in the technological heartland of the British television industry. Four minutes or so from Piccadilly Circus, Soho contains most of London's best restaurants. Many world companies. And at least half of London's theatres. It provides numerous and often illicit pleasures beyond the scope of this profile. And the best of British film and technicians and facilities. It is the focus, the fine filter, the finished edit of an entire industry. A $500 million industry, which is what makes this a prime act. Slap in the center, right on target, a most desirable piece of real estate. Pro Video's place. Of course, it's not just a place. In terms of capability, advanced technology and first class operators, it's a gold mine. Peter Fields can show you some of the scenes the company is currently working. Peter Fields, Joint Managing Director, formerly in sound broadcasting. He joined BBC Television in 1959 and specialised in colour telecine. He later joined ATV, where he remained for eight years, before leaving in 1969 to start a facilities company in the of London. In 1978, in partnership with Patrick Allen, he formed Pro Video Limited, and in addition to his management responsibilities, remains active in technical operations. This film and television come together. A lot of the program material used in broadcasting has originated on film, and the ranks in Telcelecini, we have three of them, is the world standard machine for transmitting film and for transferring it to videotape. We can process the film electric to get the best possible quality recordings, and that's what the customer wants. There's a lot more to it than just machine minding, Quite apart from Peter Field's background, our people are expert too. Actually, ProVideo are the very few companies licensed to handle nitrate film, the film on which all productions, Hollywood and elsewhere, were shot up until 1938, and many after that. Remember that? ProVideo is the exclusive supplier of videotape recordings of archived film from Pathé, British Movie Tone, and the British Film Institute. These recordings are provided for ITV stations, ITN, the BBC and over news agencies. It's big business. Brian Fields, Joint Managing Director of the company, is a skilled engineer with 15 years of work in the television facilities business behind him. What we're doing here is converting the finished presentation tape which is shot on British Standard, that's PAL, and Standard, NTSC. It's something we're very good at. Without it, what you'd be seeing would look something like this. Ugh, horrible. See what I mean? Again, good business. The interchange of television material between countries. France and Russia, for example, use a different standard from either the American or British. CCAM. It has created a great demand for higher conversion. Pro Video are among the few companies to have this machine. It's the most advanced converter in the world, ADAC. Since it does just about everything but teach language, we thought we'd get it to tell you what it costs. <laughs> Converted into Canadian dollars. Of course, a lot of what we do is bread and butter work, essential, unglamorous, painting by numbers. Quite lovers, in fact. There are specialist houses which deal with long duplication runs, and we're not into that. Nevertheless, last year we actually produced well over 80,000 duplications of various kinds from a list of which itself runs into four figures. And just as film and video converge here, so do art and science, in the Cubicomp room with a computer keyboard and this man's skill and imagination, we use science to draw for us.
You could, for instance, take this building of ours in Lexington Street and do something like this. We can make it solid or turn it round. And enable us to view this building from any angle that you can imagine. Using Cubicomp, let's look at Lexington Street floor by floor. Because we do have the space. This space. Prime site, prime location space. And the logic of what we do would be total if we could use that space to do the whole of our clients rather than part of it. Take this area, for example. What should be here is an edit suite. This edit suite and our own staff editor. Currently, when clients ask us, we have to refer them elsewhere. It hurts. Pro Video doesn't base its success solely on the high-tech equipment it employs. It's people that are important. Why, we place a high priority on the quality of the people we employ. Machines don't have imagination and skill. People do. Pro Video people do. John, our chief engineer, and his assistant, Tony Jewell. Both highly experienced and knowledgeable men. Our customers know that their precious material is in safe and skilled hands. Rick Sto on the Cubicomp. Ken Hare in Telecine. ProVideo offers not just the hardware, but also the experience and imagination customers value so highly. We for that our client list is long and varied. Pro Video has established itself as one of the leading technical facilities companies in Britain's booming film and television industry. We have the solid foundations upon which to build, the right space in the right location, the technical expertise and personnel, an established track record, and a rich client base. So where does Pro Video go from here? Patrick Allen is chairman of Pro Video. Apart from being a successful entrepreneur in the industry, he's been a leading actor in television and cinema for the past 35 years and was a founder member of the Royal Shakespeare Company. You've had a brief look at Pro Video and seen some of the things we do. You've met some of the people who make it all possible. An enthusiastic team of professionals eager into the next phase of our expansion, the setting up of a first-rate edit suite. Earlier in this presentation, we showed you that we are based right in the middle of the UK facilities market. <laughs> Within walking distance, more than 300 film and television production companies, including some of the biggest names in the business. Many of them already on our client list. Others who are not customers because we can only support part of their requirements. We tend to change that, to get a much bigger share of a market which is currently worth around $500 million a year. Yes, $500 million. This is growing steadily. A big slice of this is spent on editing these. We are convinced that when we add these to our services, we will increase revenue. And more importantly, we will increase profits by a significant amount. Well, that's the next phase. The, um, the longer term future. Well, the really big companies in our industry are not only facilities companies, although that's how some of them started out. Carlton Communications with revenues of over $114 per annum. Aspen, 33 million, and others with 20 millions in revenues. They have grown to their present size by diversifying into allied areas such as equipment manufacture and supply, program production and distribution, and satellite transmission. Pro Video Communications will be following a similar route on its way to becoming a major communications group. <laughs> Henry Ford was right need and supply it. We know what the needs are and we're eager to supply them and to supply them with skill and imagination. We are raring to go.